Hey gang, how's everybody? Welcome to Sweet Lily's Kitchen and hope everybody's doing all well. Uh, it's uh, well, mid-September here in uh, New Jersey. Uh, we're still got a little bit of still got a little bit of warm weather going. I hope everybody's uh, back to school and getting back into that uh, rest of the year groove and uh, all that good stuff. So I wanted to uh, we're going to do a little product demo and a product review today of a uh, we've been doing a lot of knives lately and we've been doing a lot of demonstrations with knives and uh, I've I've gotten a bunch of knives and. Uh, I, I gotta put them someplace. I have all these knives and I have to put them someplace. So uh, the good folks at Hoshano, remember they were the uh, folks who gave me the uh, the chef's knife that I recently did, the Lung series. I still love and I still love that. In fact, I have the knife right here, so we're gonna do uh, <clears throat> we're gonna put that to its uh, paces. But anyway, we've got this uh, magnetic knife block. All right, uh, you've, I've seen them in the past where they take the knife block and they mount it to the wall and uh, you, know, you put your knives there, you've got the slots. Those are cool, uh, but they, uh, they wanted to send me one of these knife blocks, but there's a little added uh, thing to it. It's got the actual knife sharpener, so I found that to be uh, pretty interesting. So uh, I'm gonna take this out of the box and uh, it comes in two pieces, okay? And so here's the base. Here are the screws. And here's the actual board itself. And so right here is the knife sharpener. So I'm, I'm real curious on how this plays out. So yeah. Everything lines up. The holes line up like so. And we're going to put these screws in. Nicely, as you can see. Screw in. And they're countersunk, so they will go flush. So, there you go. It's ready to go. So, let's see what this, let's see how strong this magnet is, okay? So, we'll start off with a, with a paring knife. Oh, that's easy, all right? That holds up nicely. Let's see, we use even a smaller one like so. Oh, that's good. A small Santa Coop. Ooh, very nice. Slicer. That works. An eight inch chef's knife. Boom. Nice. Another chef's knife. Boom. Nice. So, that's one side. We all kind of get the point, right? That's all well. All well and good. <laughs> all get the point. You get that? Okay. So, let's move these down a little bit. And I was very curious to find out whether or not one of these things oh yeah now we have a place to put the cleaver all right because if I got a block or so boom there's no place to put the cleaver now I got a place to put my cleaver so, that's where we are. So I like that. It's, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Eleven holding this. Pretty darn good. So let's look at this here. This is the, uh, the sharpener area, right? And how many times have I talked about the importance of a sharp knife, right? A sharp knife is safer than a dull knife. Because when you're doing your chopping and you're putting any pressure on it, the knife is going to do the work. And here we go. So, uh, let's take, well, let's take our, let's take one of these. See how this operates. All right. Now, this is a brand new knife. So, and this is the, uh, 
Oshano, Chef's Knife that we recently did, the Loom series. All right, so essentially what we'll do is we're just gonna lay this down. And we'll do this five times. What's important is you get the point done. All right, that does a nice job. That's a new knife. Let's let's see, let's see how it did. I've had one that was pretty rough. This one was pretty rough, so let's see how this does. Oh, you could hear it. You could hear it doing its job. Now, this is not to replace sharpening when you've got a damaged piece of goods, when you have a damaged knife. All right, damaged knife, you take it, send it out, get it sharpened. Uh, but this is when it's got a nice edge, you've been using it, and it's time to put that edge straight because an edge on the knife is straight. And then after cutting, you know, the little pieces at the edge get out of line. The purpose of this is to put everything back in line. So are you technically sharpening the knife? You're making it sharper by aligning the edge. So that's what we've got there. Uh, again, I like that. That looks good. And then you can display your knives. You can see them in the open. Uh, you've got your, uh, you got your aligner sharpener. Uh, to do its job, so I'll have the uh, the link to this uh, in in the description. But I really like this, and I was I was really excited to see how it would handle the cleaver, and it really it, it does its job with the cleaver. So it does the job. It holds a lot of knives, and it holds them nice and steadily. So we're real pleased with it. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you subscribe. Please, in your comments. Uh, give me some suggestions of some uh, recipes that we can uh, do moving forward. Uh, I know uh, Oktoberfest is coming, so there's some German cooking I want to uh, uh, demonstrate for you guys. But uh, on that end, again, thanks for watching, and we'll see you real soon. Bye-bye.